right, y'all. Back at you for episode number 38 of the Planting Pirates. Yeah. This is where we're gonna uh, show you. We're gonna show you where we're gonna plant all these plants around our yard. These are the free plants we got in our Plant Pirates episode number 38. So um, before we plant them, um, we've had some questions on what we do to some of them to get them ready to plant. And really, we don't do much. Um, we just do some, right now they're sitting in a bucket of water and we'll pull them out here in just a minute. We'll organize them and we'll prune them up a little bit. And then basically we just stick them right in the ground. We don't use root hormone. We don't, uh, we don't really use anything else. So um, I'm going to hand the camera over to Teddy and we'll just give you an example uh, real quick of how we clean up these um, tea plants and the dracaenas and stuff like that. And, um, and then we'll go plant them all. Hey yeah. bud. So really the first thing I do like this one right here this cutting looks pretty good some of these leaves are coming off I'm just gonna go ahead and pull the bottom leaves off this one but that one looks pretty good there's not much else I'm gonna do to it I do skin the bottom of the cuttings a little bit um, to help promote root root growth um, I've noticed it does help some on these tea plants uh, especially in the winter time in the summertime it seems like they'll take no matter what but um, really that's all we do um, you can see some of these that we have here don't look as great. Um, so we'll clean these up even more. Like, uh, this one's pretty sorry. I'm not even sure we're going to use this one. This one right here is kind of long and gangly. I'll probably cut it about right here. Um, and then just keep the, that little bit. Same with this one right here. You can see it's on this big stalk, but I'll probably just cut it about right here. Keep this piece right here. Um, let's see, and then we do about the same thing for these guys right here. You can see this is kind of a long piece. Um, I could probably leave it like that. I might, I might leave this one like that and just kind of give it a little, get a little skidding down here. So basically we'll just go through and um, do that to the rest of these. Some of these we've never tried. We've never tried to root this one from a cutting, but we're gonna give it a try. Um, I might skin this one too. This is a real woody plant right here, this bottle brush uh, tree. Um, you guys watched our Plant Pirates episode. We got this, but um, this variegated ginger, we've never had luck uh, transplanting. So we're not even, I'm not even gonna try that. But um, we're gonna go ahead and clean up the rest of this stuff um and then plant it and um we'll get back with you when everything's planted and show you where we put it all right y'all so teddy and i you can see we got our work done here um we got everything kind of cleaned up and put in the ground and then we cleaned up all of our mess so i think we're ready to show everybody where we put everything right yeah, yeah. all right let's go over here we'll start up here and then work our way um towards the back I think the first thing we have up here is the pineapple we got. Where'd I put that? It's Where'd I put it? Right here. Right here we go. Yeah. We got this pineapple right here. It's uh, got a ways to go before we get a pineapple from it, but uh, it's definitely a head start from planting a pineapple top, eh? Yeah. yeah. It has roots. Yeah, it does. Yeah. So then we actually have lots of other pineapples that are uh, going off right now. In fact, I'll uh, show you guys. Uh, uh, one of the flowers right here. Yeah, so we put it right here. This is kind of our trial bromeliad bed. We throw plants in along this uh, hedge of areca's right here um, just to get them started. And then when, when we find a better spot for them, we move them around. In fact, I think, yeah, we put this here too, right, right here. So that's where this one went. And all we did was uh, skin the bottoms of these and just shove them right in the ground. Yeah. Right, bud? So I think that's all for up here. I, oh, I put the pothos over here. On this cabbage palm right here. So I just love this pothos vine. It's so tropical looking. I'm hoping, hoping it'll grow up just this one cabbage palm. Here it is right here, guys. And all I did for this one, there wasn't a lot of dirt to dig into around the base of this cabbage palm. You can see the cabbage palm roots, are just, they're pretty much on the surface. So I just took like a half a bucket of dirt and uh, draped this 
vine around the base of the cabbage palm and just dump the dirt on the vine right there. And I've had luck doing that in the past, so I think it'll be okay. Oh, we're gonna get some rain, aren't we? Oh, yeah. And we've been getting rain day after day, but that's good this time of year. The days are getting longer, we're getting rain. Plants are gonna start growing. Stoked. All right, and then we put more stuff down here. Oh, look at this. Got a monarch butterfly, guys. Trying to lay an egg. Whoa. What a bee it looks like he was chasing. Yeah, you can see the, we got milkweed here. That's what the monarch is after. But then we also have this uh, African blue basil in the background. It's just loaded down with bees. It's always loaded down with bees all day long. And we planted this. Oh, look, it just laid an egg. Did it? You think that's the egg? I don't know. Maybe. All right. Anyways, the African blue basil, you guys can see there's just bees all over and we've planted it all around our property uh, to attract pollinators. Um, and they just love it. All right, let's show them the rest of the plants. Oh, there's Teddy. There's some milkweed seed right there. You guys can see we're starting to get milkweed popping up everywhere. There's some right there, there. There, we got some back there. This is a new kind, we just got pink. Yeah, I think this is a native variety right here. And then look, we got a bunch more back here. So, we like our butterflies. All right, what we got back here, bud? What we put back here? Do you remember? So, yeah, sequins. Yeah, show them. Show them what we got, show them what we got. Right, not the same shiny, but these. Yeah, so we got these tea plants right here. I think this might be from like the weird color, a new yeah. one, but I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. It has cool leaves. These cuttings look pretty sorry, but uh, they'll bounce back, especially now that we're getting back into the season here. And they'll catch some drip off of this roof too. It'll help them. All right, I think we planted another tea plant down here, didn't we? Yeah, that's right. We got this one right here. This was the Auntie Lou right here. We only have one of that one. We only have one other one of that one. We collect tea plants, guys. You can see we have we have lots of different varieties. I think we have several varieties just right here, don't we? Yeah. Oh look, this one. Look, we got this one right here. This is a half one. Yeah, we got this one on uh, the last episode of Plant Pirates, I think, and it's doing good right here. But this one's been in the ground for probably three weeks now. Oh yeah, here's another one. Black Magic. Yeah. All right, in all honesty, guys, I actually bought this one. Um, these right here, we got on the curb on the side of the road. Look, they're all putting off new leaves. Look at that. Yeah, look at this. Yeah. Look at that. Trying to hide my pool equipment here. But. All right, well, that's good. We had a good week. We got several yeah. different varieties of uh, tea plants and some other stuff. Um, we're just getting back into the season here, guys. Um, you know, it's we're, we're finally getting into it's not quite spring yet, but we got through daylight savings time, so it's, we're almost there. So uh, things are starting to grow. Super stoked, eh, bud? Yeah. All right, all right, y'all. If you have any questions or comments about any of the plants um, we showed you here today, just post down below. Until next time, everybody out there, take care. Bye.